Mm, I better fish. Whacked. This is a better fish here. I got totally thumped on that one, bud. So what advice do you have for people when they're fighting a bigger fish like this on a fly rod? Just I notice keep, you're not doing keep what Keep that I, rod yeah. low, man. Keep that rod low. Use the power of the rod, you know? I'm fishing 20 pounds, so you can pull on these fish pretty hard. I think a lot of people don't pull on fish hard enough, you know? I think you can really... I notice when you're pulling on them, though, you're not really pulling on them with the backbone of the rod so much. When you start pulling, you still make sure you're somewhat pointing at the fish, not full yeah, parabolic Yeah, yeah, pulls. right. As soon as you start lifting like this, yeah. now I'm into the lighter part of the rod that has no power. So I'm keeping the rod nice and low, lifting, pulling, lifting. Right. Keeping that rod low the entire time. Here he comes. What do we got? That's yeah. a good one. You run a 20 pound leader on that, John? Yeah, 20 pound fluorocarbon, usually straight 20 pound, or I might run like a 30 pound butt, but the total leader length is about seven, eight feet. There's there a fish. Go. You know, I was wondering if you were gonna show up. <laughs> You know, we've been here for a whole 10 minutes and you hadn't caught one. <laughs> that's a pretty decent one. Yeah? It's a pretty decent fish. Yeah. He's a giant. That's awesome, man. Oh, that's a good that's one. That's a really good one, bud. How long does it take you on a fly rod when they get close to the boat? You got to fight them for a while and get them to get tired or what? I'll, no, I'll not necessarily. No, not necessarily. I mean, you, you can I mean, you can do the same things you can with the gear rod on them. Just kind of keep the wood on them. Wait, one, of the, one of the biggest mistakes a fly angler can make is in this stage when you're right next to the when the fish is coming up to the surface like this yeah. is to lift the rod and you know start biting them off the tip so I got to keep that rod nice and low and is that because it just is not gonna it doesn't have the power up at the tip yeah and you start put all the, the fulcrum point moves up the rod and gets into that thinner portion of the rod and that's a great way to break your, break your rod nice yeah, that's a good one. That is a beauty. That's awesome. Very cool. Yeah, she's pretty. I'm gonna let her go. Yeah. I come out here, chartreuse and white, always. That's just, I, I mean, if I'm gonna pick up a fly rod, I have no experience, I yeah. know that gets bit, but I notice you're throwing a darker pattern today. Yeah, chartreuse over white, it's really hard to beat. Um, sometimes in this more stained water like we have here, that black shows up really well too. Okay. So I'm fishing a black back over a white colored body. Um, kind of a medium size, you know, three to four inches, like on a two aught or three aught hook. Okay. Um, and that clouds are motion with that flash tail, really elicits those grabs. Awesome. Let's see All if we can get back on them. Let's get another one. We just had a phenomenal evening on the water with uh, John Sherman. John's a phenomenal fly fisherman, well known in the fly fishing community, and I got the privilege to go out with him today, and he's a good friend of mine. And I want to get you guys out there that are watching this familiar with us with an application that is available for an iPad and for Droid applications called Fish Head software is that what you guys are calling it fish head app fish head yeah. apps fish head app you want to talk a little bit about that you, uh, you gave uh, it to me on a prototype yep i use it every time i go out on the water with awesome. weather tide it plans my day 
It's phenomenal. Why, awesome. why don't you let people know about it? Yeah, I, I'm a, I was an early adopter of, of, of an iPhone and iPhone applications, and I always found myself jumping between two or three different applications, right. and I wanted one that anglers could use that you could look at weather, you could look at tide information, you could look at moon phase, all at the palm of your hand. Right. And so Fish Head really originated here in the Delta, and with all the wind dynamics that we have out here, I wanted to know if it's worth making a run 20 miles out west, is the wind blowing out there? So Fish Head combines weather, it combines the tide information, it combines, um, it gives you wind buoy information, it gives you, uh, if you're out running offshore, it gives you a bunch of great info out there. If you're a ri river angler, if you're out fishing your local stream, you wanna know what the river flows are doing, you can see all that all, all in the palm of your hand. So it's a really useful, useful And, and for me, I mean, I, I mean it, it's, it's a huge app for multiple fishermen, lakes, waters, and rivers like you're talking about. But for those of you on the Delta, and you guys wanna know your tides, which is, which is me. The Tide app is phenomenal. The ability to go to the exact area I'm at, pull my tide information, and by simply rotating the screen, I get a full graph of the tide, and I can go forward and backward and see what it's gonna be, what it's been, and plan my day, John. Awesome, awesome, awesome application, yeah, I love cool. it. Yeah, I dig it, it's, it's, it's a lot of fun. I, I mean, I was pretty selfish when I created it. I wanted something <laughs> for myself, for the fishing that I do, and it's been real useful for a lot of anglers. Yeah. And for the, the Delta fishermen, it's kind of That's the perfect cool. uh, app to have out on the water with okay. it. We'll put some information at the bottom of the screen right now for you so you know where to, where to get it and what to look for. Thanks for joining us on Fish Delta TV, and uh, hopefully we get to get out with you again. That was yeah, a lot of fun. Let's do it bud. again. All right, right bud, thank you Thanks, so man. much. Appreciate it, thank All you. Right.